Hey Leos, welcome to my channel, Indigo Goddess 1111. I'm here bringing you your channeled messages straight from spirit. Um, this message will not resonate with everybody, so just take what fits and leave what don't, and just remember this is for entertainment purposes only. So Leo, you guys are going through a tough time right now. Your number of the month is six, which is focusing on balancing your spiritual and material worlds. You guys, I'm getting a couple different things here. So for a group of you, you are dealing with heartbreak. You have allowed that heartbreak to move from your heart to your head. You are now full of doubt, question, wondering, anxiety, depression, sleepless nights, crying yourself to sleep over this relationship that ended in your past. And you are finding out some sort of truths that you did not know about in the relationship while it was going on. Um, For a group of you, for a group of you, this ended, this was the, the mother or father of your children. And you're wanting that person back. You are the one that left. You cut it off because there is either people outside of your marriage coming in or they weren't treating you as their number one priority. You are wanting this person to come back. This person is coming back. They have a new sense of like maturity. They want to put this family back together. They want to be better for you. They are coming back for a second chance. They have a lot of guilt about what they put you through, about what they did, about not putting you first. And they are truly sorry. They are coming back a more balanced individual, but you need to heal from the situation if it's going to work. For group of you, this is a Virgo but it doesn't have to be for all of you. This person has retreated. This person has went spiritually deep and healed. And that's what spirit is calling for you to do now. For, for another person, for another group of you, you're still heartbroken from secrets that are coming out or from secrets Something with secrets. You ended it with this person because of cheating. And they weren't offering anything to the relationship. All you were getting was headaches and heartaches. Time and time and time again. So you cut this person off. But you're not healing from it. You took this person out of your life, but you're not healing. You're just being defensive, defensive and guarded. You're trying really hard to get over this loss, but you're avoiding dealing with the things that really hurt because it hurts. Your scars are still wide open and they cut deep because you trusted this person you gave this person your all and they took it like it was a joke. Like you are an option, not a priority. And that's making you so guarded that you are afraid to open up again. You are, you are afraid of this person that you cut out at one time in your life. Spirit is saying heal and stay true to what you believe in. 
Stay true to what you need, what you want, and what you expect, and don't settle for less. If this person doesn't fit the bill, cut them out again. Because you deserve happiness. You, you deserve it all. For a different group of you, this hurt you so bad, you feel sick from it. You feel sick to your stomach. You're sad, you're depressed. You're not getting out of bed. Spirit's saying it's time to get out of bed, put your big girl panties on, and deal with this heartache. Because the world's passing you by. Opportunities are passing you by. Love is passing you by. You need to heal and you need to love yourself first. Because for those of you who are accepting like these lower vibration people to do this and you keep taking them back, you're not loving yourself. Because if you loved yourself enough, you wouldn't put yourself through that heartache. You wouldn't allow these people to use you. For a group of you Leos, you have a twin flame though coming back. That is this person that you are wishing for, hoping for. They are coming back. They are returning to your life. Their offer is going to be small at first because that's all they have to give. Remember unconditional love and to let them know that it's okay for them to come back. For a group of you, your twin flame is not going to come back until you heal. That's why spirit is so stressed on healing, like stressing the issue. You need to heal, heal, heal heal because your love is waiting right right here but it can't cross that line until until you are balanced until are you the best you until you love yourself first and foremost in front of everybody your kids your parents everybody because if you love yourself first you're going to be that much better of a person to those people so it's not selfish to love yourself first it's a necessity and in turn, it'll bring happiness, love, fulfillment, abundance, spiritual growth. You'll have the ten, the, the ten of cups, the ten of pentacles. You'll have it all. You just have to work on yourself first. And it's going to hurt. Because those are deep cuts. It's going to hurt like hell. But look at what is on the other side waiting for you. So be strong, be brave, be your beautiful self, and embrace this change, embrace this transformation, and allow that love to come in. Those are your channel messages, Leo. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys have a beautiful month of March, and I hope you guys take the time to work on yourself because anytime you invest in yourself, it's always going to bring a positive. So as always, I wish you guys love, light, and may God bless you on your journey.